How are you doing, everyone? Joe from Hog Announce. I am having a great day. I hope you're having a great day. A spectacular day. Today was a gorgeous day here in New Jersey. And you know why I'm having a great day, guys? Because Autumn finally today locked up. Now let's get on with Autumn's journey here. Autumn came out of brumation December 6th. And today is 42 days at normal temperatures for her when it comes to her lockup. But, you know, that's a little late, you know, uh, you know, it's, a, it's above the average when it comes to pairing. But you know what? I think we may be OK. I'm going to let you know the reason why. When it comes to Autumn out of brumation, she was pretty sluggish. She wasn't too active. She was on the cool side for the most part when I put her back in a terrarium. She would go on the warm side during the day for a couple hours, then go straight over to the cool side when I got home at night. So I tried to pair her about four times with Tiny Tim and to no avail, I did not confirm a lockup. Not saying they didn't lock up, but you know what? I don't think they did because Autumn's weight is about four grams over what it was when she came out of brumation as of yesterday. So with my other two gravid females, Syl and also Annie, they picked up a ton of weight so far in the last two weeks, and uh, Autumn wasn't showing that. But two weeks ago, Autumn started going through shed. So I'm thinking, well, maybe she's having a late ovulation shed the temperatures might have been not in her favor to go into ovulation when it came to the pairing i'm not sure but you know what she shed it yesterday morning i fed her yesterday after work she took a meal like that and to add here she did not feed she has not fed in about two and a half weeks so when i got home boom she took the medial mouse right away so i said you know what let me try pairing tomorrow morning with tiny tim and also Nirvana because, you know, let the males go at it. Let them compete because when the males compete and you put two males in with a female, usually you can get a lockup fairly quick. So I woke up this morning and I said, you know what? Let me get Tiny Tim. Let me get Nirvana. I put them both in Autumn's terrarium and I had my uh, blink camera right up top so I can watch them at work to confirm a lockup like I did with Syl and Annie. So it takes me about 45 minutes to get to work. As soon as I got to work, I turned on my blink app, turned on the camera, and lo and behold, boom there was a lockup. Now, I really wanted Tiny Tim to lock up with Autumn because double head snow, double head snow. I was trying to hit snows this year, but you know what? It's a grind right now, guys. We're, you know, the clock is ticking on getting a lockup with Autumn. So Nirvana just uh, stepped it up yet again. You know, Nirvana stepped it up yet again. And this should give us a uh, 50% head snow, double head snow with this clutch on all our babies with the possibility, I think it's like 50% will be Arctic's. So guys, I'm extremely happy. That's two gravid females and a lockup on Annie. So that's three females, you know, hopefully producing a lot of eggs in the next, you know, three to four weeks. I'm really happy. So there's your update on Autumn. I'm really, really happy for her. And uh, I'm really excited to see what she produces this year. But before we get out of here, let me show you the video, a couple videos of the lockup that I caught today on my blank video camera. So there you have it, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this update on Autumn. Guys, we're in the season. We're going. Eggs in about two and a half weeks with Syl. Maybe three weeks tops. Getting really excited here, guys. This is this is the time we should start getting excited right now, man. So let's get a lot of uh, you know, uh, fertile eggs with Syl and Annie, and uh, let's produce some awesome babies this year. All right, everybody. You have a great rest of your week. I will see you in the next video. This is Joe from Hogging Outs. I am Audi. Saint Audi. Cheers. <laughs>